Oh, hola, amigos. It is time for a second Last Dinner video. So I checked the previous Last Dinner video, and that video got a lot of support. Uh, what was it? 1k likes? 1,000 likes? Was it that much? I think that's how much I got on that Last Dinner video. You guys uh, impressed me. So I came back for a second Last Dinner video. I mean, I should do this a little bit, you know, more frequent because um, that video I posted was one week ago. So I should do them a little bit more frequent. But anyways, let's jump into the gameplay. Of course, starting the video off with a dead character. I uh, was dead in my base. I always die in my base. Still did not repair my base, guys. Still did not do that. This is my dead body here. Let's take it all. Boom, 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 boom. Take everything we can. And guys, I logged in earlier and I saw a goddamn wrecked ship. Or what was that? Shipwreck? Something like that. Let's go check it out and I'm gonna gear up myself too. And also, I have to repair my walls too. So let me do that. So there we go. I kinda repaired the walls. Kinda didn't. I don't know how I did, but... You know, I have a feeling that repairing these walls and making it stone, I don't think it's worth it, man. I think I should just go full metal and start building these stone walls like we don't need them because they do get destroyed by raiders and it's a waste of stone walls. So I think the best thing for me would be just, you know, cover my wall base in metal, pretty much. But we're not going to be doing that because we have no idea when Metal Cutter is going to release. So I'll just stick with this base, obviously. And then I'll just slowly start expanding, making small metal rooms or something like that. And then, yeah, our base is going to be unraidable. Well, I already did. We have some progress, guys. We're like 1% complete because this is like the start. I can now start, you know... <laughs> continue this metal wall till the very end and surround my wall base with metal walls. I'm gonna gear up for the shipwreck. I don't know how tough it is, but I'm gonna take SWAT armor. Obviously the best armor in the game currently. Not sure if there's any better armor than SWAT, unless they have released that. I'm gonna put that away. Pretty much, guys, all I have to do now, I think we're set. I don't know if I'll need those metal weapons, but let's try doing shipwreck for the first time. Let's see how it goes. I'll take my chopper, I guess. I don't know if we should take the chopper or not, but I'll take my chopper. Although I did not do any notes, I didn't do any tasks, I did not play last day at all after I recorded the video. But let's see what's happening here. Let's run. Let's see, can I enter this or not? I'm really curious guys really curious the sound in game though is so loud bro. It is so freaking loud Oh, we can enter so let's see what happens uh, Oh What's going on stop him here in the aviation will flatten everything try not to die. There is a choppa. Why is there a choppa? Oh my god. Hello. Okay, so this is how we kill this guy just use the chopper and I see how this works. I see how this works. So we just have to kill him by leading him into the bombs, huh? Is that how it works? I think that's how it works, huh? Yeah, that's how it works. So we don't have to use durability at all. I'm just gonna wait it out. Oh, he spawned some zombies. Sailors. Let's kill these sailors, boy. Let's kill those sailors. He doesn't do damage at all, man. You're weak, Charlie. You're weak. Okay, we're gonna run here. I'm pretty sure the zombies can die too from the bombs. I'm sure they can. Dude, that choppa is hella loud, huh? Okay, there we go. We're gonna kill the zombies too. Yeah. Dude, this is easy, man. I thought it's gonna be hella hard. Okay, let's get... Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna spawn some more zombies. They just keep crawling out of this shipwreck. That's it. And he just does three damage, dude. Nothing really much. You know what? I'll swap to my machete because I can. And we're just gonna keep relying on these bombs from that helicopter. Why are you dropping such small bombs, huh? Drop some bigger bombs. Drop some bigger bombs, homie. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Get that damage in, boys. Get that damage in. He does not run so fast, you know? Not at all. We're almost there, guys. We're halfway there. Just a little bit more to hit. Okay, he's spawning more zombies. Doesn't seem like a hard event at all. Does not. My machete does only two damage to him, though. So definitely don't use guns when fighting this guy, okay? Do not. So far, we're doing great. We got that bomb. Look at that. We're doing some juicy damage. Can I get that one? No, we didn't get that one, man. Come on, dude, just a little bit more. I'm trying... Dude, if I get into the bomb, I'm dead. I, I'm pretty sure I'll die in one shot. This man can tank a lot of hits, but if I get into the bomb, I'm pretty sure I'm dead. Oh, there we go. We got one. I think that at this point, I'm just wasting my SWAT set, you know? It's just a waste, and I did not need to use my medkit at all there. All right, there we go. I think he's gonna spawn more soon. 
Bam, we got him. And 295 health more. Almost there, guys. Almost there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Can I get a bomb next to me? Oh, we got him. Sniped, boy. Just one more bomb. And I'm pretty sure he's gonna die. Dude, there's a lot of zombies, man. I need to... Oh, this is gonna hurt a little bit, guys. Because I did not kill a single zombie after he spawned them. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, oh, look at that cleanup. We cleaned it up pretty good. All of them got caught in that bomb. Oh, we got this. There we go. Task completed. That wasn't so bad, was it, guys? And he dropped big bones. So we did this just for a task. That was just for a task. Week two, week three. Take part in the final battle with Charlie. <laughs> so this was the final battle, dude. This was the final battle. What was the first battle? What was the second battle? Oh, participate in the clear clearing out event. All right, let's go do that. So I guess this was just for a task, just for the season task to complete. I see, ya, I see, ya, game. So will I get this? Oh. Oak bushes? No, that's not what I need. So... How do we get the clearing event, guys? Huh? How do you get that? How does it work? I'm really lazy, guys, to grind out these tasks. Collect 10 aid boxes, check 10 basements. What are basements? What are those? Alright, so guys, I took too many guns for that uh, Charlie fight. Basically, we did not need a single gun. We had to just run around and all that stuff. Final pages to unlock a new event. You know, this seems a little bit too much, guys, but we did one task in week 3, but we didn't do any of the other tasks we should be doing those i don't know if i'll be finishing all of them but uh maybe i'll do some grinding actually so i want to check out what's going on in the limestone ridge or something like that or limestone cliffs because i saw what was this a dealer just a dealer okay i'm not gonna bother the dealer now in the tasks it said where was it check 10 basements appear by chance basements are found in zones i'm pretty sure that's what i think they're found in zones right so those basements so i'm supposed to go to a red zone and then i should be able to find a basement there or what i'm actually uh, a little bit excited to check it out because i did not know about that let's go to pine woods because it's closer in 26 energy all right and torino okay okay getting already cammed by these spitters man god damn these guys are annoying he drops a bunker card thank you i don't need that much appreciated but no thanks so now we got some gear. Let's try to find the basement. Probably not. Probably gonna be really rare. We found a bag. Is this bag gonna have something good, man? Mm -mm -mm -mm. It has beans and all that stuff. Yeah, nothing really fancy and a ticket. I don't really know if I need to collect those tickets. I can open this for sure, yeah. That's a tier 3 locked box. Might get a grenade. Yeah, hoo hoo hoo. We got a nade, boys. Got. Feeling pretty lucky today, guys. Feeling pretty lucky. Might as well just use that grenade against, like, 20 zombies. God damn, we're getting lucky, huh? We're getting a road sign and all that. But yeah, no basements here. No basements. So that's not cool. Oh, who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Who that? Who this? Who this? Who this? Is that a girl, man? Because I see... That's some nice booty you got there. Oh, they spit at you, too. God damn. You spit pretty fast. Alright, clean up, clean up. Get them out of my face. They drop you rope. Oh, and they drop you notes. Note 15, note 6. This sheet got shabby, but you can sort something out there. Okay, let's see what those notes say. So this is a note 6, this is a note 15. Read. Okay, well, I guess I'm reading them in the diary, right? Okay, so this is... I literally have no idea what it's gonna say, because, you know, it's, it's note 6, this is note 15. I need to collect note 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and all that to realize what's going on, but... Since I don't have all the notes, I can't really uh, understand the story. So yeah, I guess when you collect all the notes, there's a, like a story. Um, yeah, there's another bag here. I'm not sure what I should be doing right now. I really want to complete those tasks. Toxic Abomination. Phew, get away from me, man. Get away from me. And Captain. Ooh, who the hell? So this is what I'm actually looking for. I could uh, use advantage of those Toxic Abominations to, you know kill their fellas and we got another midshipman i think it's not a good idea to run around like this and gather more zombies i don't really like that but let me swap to my machete i think i'll just clean them up with melee for now and try to kill them pretty much i'll heal up when i hit uh, under 20 health because that's my med kit comes in place i'm gonna equip my machete real quick punch this guy and equip it back let's just wipe this guy out I'll punch the rest. There we go. Dude, does he drop anything? He does not drop anything at all. These guys drop junk and this guy drops rope. 
All right, man, nothing too much here going on, but this guy dropped another note. This is a note 17. So I guess I have to get all those notes. I'm pretty sure you can get like four or five notes one week, and then next week you can get four or five again, then next week you can get four or five again or something like that. Or, uh, wait, this is the last week, right? I think there's gonna be another week, though. Right now I found three notes, though. I'm pretty sure I missed out a lot because first week I wasn't there, second week I wasn't there, third week, well, I'm here. So maybe I'll find all those notes. Who knows, guys? Who knows? I'm gonna punch this guy to death. Hey, hey, hey. I don't know why I'm doing that, though. Don't ask, guys. I'm trying to save durability. Okay, this... Transistors. I'm pretty sure I was low on transistors once, so I'll try to uh, keep those. Midshipman again. Why is it called a man when it's a girl, dude? Goddamn. So I got the same note. Note 6. Anyways, let's get out of this zone. There's nothing really much to find in this zone. I really want to find basements, man. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, we got an airdrop, so definitely I'll visit the airdrop. <laughs> Why not, man? Fetch some goodies from that. But still, dude, where can I find my basement? Oh man, I really do not like using my machete on 4 HP zombie. Hell no. And we got a pupper. So yeah, guys, I completely forgot that I, uh, today is the update on Last Dinner. If I literally uh, started playing again because there was an update. And wow, I have never got a blue blueprint in an airdrop. Seems like I'm lucky today, guys. Seems like I'm lucky today. LDO gods are rewarding. What do I do with this note, though? Do I, I probably get rid of it, man. I don't need it. And I'll take the yellow ticket. One yellow ticket is more worth than three green tickets, right? And yeah, pretty much. I am stacked, man. But I'm stacked with junk, though. I got garbage. I could put this in here. could put that in here. That in here. I don't know what else I could put. That, that, and this because it's not stackable sector 7 has an update right now so they added some food types or something like that if i'm not mistaken they've added a couple things man but it's not like a huge update i must say it's not like a huge update okay if you go to news we can check the news in the game i forgot completely forgot so they show all the update notes in the news tab but for some reason this is not popping dude so I guess I'm, I'm not seeing the update notes for today, because I'm clicking news, the game is not showing anything, man. So, okay, fair, please fix that, please, for me, please fix that, because I can't check it out. Man, I really want to get those basements, dude, I want to see how they work like. Another spitter coming in, I'm gonna punch him. So this is what I have to do, man. I literally have to two-shot a spitter with my machete, and then unequip my machete to one-shot him with my fist, so... That's like how it goes, because I really hate... There, here, again, see guys, we gotta fist kill him, because the 4 HP man, like, do you guys really want to use your machete, 38 damage on a goddamn 4 HP zombie, I don't think anyone wants to do that, anyways, I gotta clean up this, oh no 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 no, do not stun me man, let me do some clean up here, real quick, real quick, some clean up guys, also the sound is so high, hold on guys, hold on, there we go, I, Lowered my sound a little bit, just a little bit, not much, but not too low. And yeah, we should be better right now. I got spit, god damn it. Got a wolf coming in, got a big one coming in. What else, man? Is that the big one? Oh, that's not the big one. That's a goddamn Charlie. Charlie, what are you doing? Is that does he do a lot of damage though? No, he doesn't. Dude, I thought I, I thought that was the big one, man. I thought that was the big one. To be honest, that's what I thought. Oh no, that's pretty crazy, dude. He almost stunned me. Dude, when the ground was shaking, I was like, what, what, who this, who this, man? Who's happening? What's going on? I gotta punch this guy. Wait, did he just heal back? I think he did. Do I kill him? Or do I leave him? Do I have to kill this fella or not? Melee damage does not do much damage to him. Nine damage with a machete. He keeps spawn. he just keeps spawning these guys, bro. Again, over and over. They keep coming. Do I have to kill this guy, guys? Let me know in the comment section. I'm not gonna be doing it right now because I'm not prepared. This guy dropped some uh, notes. Colonel dropped me some notes. This guy also dropped me some notes. So yeah, I do 11 damage. Yeah, I'm gonna kill these officers. They don't drop anything. Okay, I'm out. I'm, I'm out, man. Adios. I ain't effing around with that, man. Ooh, oak clearing. Wait, oak bushes? Oak clearing? What? Does that make sense? Oh, clearing up. That's probably the Charlie event, guys. It's probably that Charlie event. Do I learn this? Yes. Note 14 and note 8. Okay, let's learn all of them. We got now how many? We got 3, 4... Okay, what? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 notes. That math, though, dude. Anyways, drive, drive, drive. We're gonna check out that oh, clearing. 
even though it's not all clearing, I guess. But let's see. I gotta deposit some junk that I got. Did I get the sun? Ah, oh, I got the sublet from an airdrop. That's where I got it from. So I guess we're taking us once it again, boys and girls. But I swear to God, this fight's gonna be easy again, dude. I don't know what to tell you guys. I don't know. So we got Katana. Maybe I should go melee, you know. Shouldn't be using my firearms. And got some medkits. I'm pretty sure these medkits are enough, dude. I'm pretty sure they're enough. There's nothing else I need. I have two AKs, a Glock, and Katanas. I'm gonna modify this thing, though. And yeah, we got everything. Everything is... We're looking great. Okay, I cleaned my chopper. Our chopper does not have anything at all. I'm gonna take this off, dude. This engine goes off. And there we go. Put that there. Let's ride our chopper. So let's go to that Oak Clearing event. Bro, I, I hope I'm prepared, man, because this time, I, I hope it's not something hard, you know? If it's easy, then it's easy, but I hope it's not something too bad, okay? Oh, clearing, so let's go there, drive. All right, here we go. Well, oh, we already have some fellas. We already have some fellas. Oh, we have a lot of fellas. Oh, 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 oh. Let's take our AK, clean up, clean up. Nothing too much. If this is just an oh, clearing, dude, I don't know. I think I, I might have mistaken it. The, there was another event. The oak event and the oak clearing. I think this is the actual oak clearing event, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I don't know, man. I've never been... I never I never did this, though. I never did this, so I don't know what event is this. I'm gonna take my saw blade and just one-shot them. Yeah, kill your uh, friends. I just did... Oh, my God. Okay, I need to kill that spitter. I need to kill that spitter. There we go. One shot, he's dead. And I'm gonna use my swat set you know, on the boss fight or whatever, thing like that. Oh, I almost died. Did you guys saw that? I think I was 15 HP or something like that. Let's punch him to death. I love punching them to death. Loot these fellas. So this isn't the Charlie event. This is the actual Oak Clearing event, guys. Oh my god, the Jebate though, man. The Jebate. Getting some of these guys. Fast biters. Ooh, fancy backpack you got there, boy. Is that a raider? Yeah, that walks like a survivor. Um, my armor broke. I'm gonna kill him with my Glock, though. He has a trash zip gun, some berries, pine logs. I'll loot everything, dude. We got that stuff going. Okay, we can loot this, too. I didn't come here for Oak. I came here for Charlie, but I guess he's not here. I guess I got mistaken. So we got junk. Uh, I'll take the plant fabric, I guess. So there's nothing here. Let's leave this area. Man, the Jebate is real, though. I got tricked, and that doesn't feel good. We got another airdrop, but sadly not gonna do that now. Let's drive oak bushes. So if this is the oak bushes, or I don't know, man. Because someone told me, man, that it looks like the same as a oak event. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is the Charlie event. This is the Charlie event. Yeah, should be. Or isn't it? Yep, 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 yep. That's what it is. Oh, what's this? What the heck? You guys are trying to kill that thing? I'm gonna kill all of these guys, man. I'm gonna kill all of these raiders. All of them gonna be dead. Do their weapons break, though? That's the question. I wonder. I probably shouldn't even kill those raiders, you know? Leave them alive so they can help me kill the Charlie guy. But that's probably not gonna happen, though. He keeps spawning a lot of enemies, that's for sure. I do 9 damage to him. Hmm. You know, guys, I have a feeling, though, that I have to kill this guy in red zones. Then I have to kill him in, you know, this event. Then in the shipwreck. And that's how the story goes on. I'm pretty sure that's what happens. Um, my armor's gonna break right now. It already broke. I'm gonna put on my shoes. That and that. And heal up, you know. Save my medkits. I'm not really saving much, but, you know, I'm risking... More like I'm risking death. I don't know why I swapped to that zip gun for that second there. But I guess I'm just using Katana to wipe him out. And look at that. That raider does not lose his durability. He's still chopping him. Let me try that zip gun for a second. It does four damage, dude. A zip gun does 4 damage, but a katana does 9 damage, dude. So that zip gun is hella weak. Hella weak, dude. I think he's gonna spawn more. Wait, where are you running? What the? What the? What just happened? Why did he leave? He just escaped. Is that normal? And that raider disappeared too. God damn it. Pretty much, I think this was pointless. I don't know. I don't know what happened, guys. I don't know, man. Is he supposed to run away? Or what? These guys did not drop notes. Did this guy drop note? He did. Note 13. Okay. We're gonna keep collecting that. Maybe I'm supposed to, you know, kill these zombies to get notes and then see what it says or something like that. I don't know. Clearly don't understand what those notes mean, but hopefully, dude, this guy was supposed to run away because if not, I don't know if I was supposed to kill him or if he's supposed to run away, but I think that was a waste. God damn it. 
Although, let me know in the comment section, guys, what's going on here, because I'm missing out completely everything in this season. I'm missing out completely all those notes. I'm not sure what's going on. I didn't do any tasks, so maybe I'm just missing out on the story, you know, maybe I'll, I have to, like, follow the story and then do the Charlie event or something like that, but yeah. Also, we got a rest stop in addition, so I guess I'll do that. I'm gonna delete this, man. And, yeah, I got my AK. Let's just drive there. Boom, enter. Hopefully, we can get a good one. Who knows? Okay, we got the same goddamn survivor, dude. So I'll just use my katana to chop him off. Boom, 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 boom. Spring. Okay, we don't need that. I'ma heal up. Get my AK. I'ma use this AK first. So I can break it faster, you know? They got wiped out pretty fast. Thank you for that Glock. Thank you for those weapons. This guy was using a, uh, what? Where's this weapon go? This guy did not even drop a weapon, so did they nerf it or something like that? Swapping that jacket for that. This guy dropped the Glock, but that guy didn't, though. That's weird. One aluminum ore for one Tiklov? I don't know. I guess I'll take anything I get, you know, in this event. Because why freaking not? Let's just check the choppers right now. They might have some good stuff. Might not have good stuff. Thank God, no zombie horde. Thank God. We got a machete, two aluminum bars. Okay, sweet, sweet. I'll take it. That's cool. Take it, take it, take it. Boom. All right. We could take those bricks. Um, there's nothing else to take, though. Iron ores? I don't know, man. We got everything I need. The plant fiber, though. Ooh, look at that. We got a red ticket. I'll take that gas. I'll come back here again, okay? Come back here again. I gotta take it all, then. I'm gonna delete this jacket, actually, and put this gas in. I'm gonna fill up this gas. Put it back there. We got some medkits. And I'm gonna delete this flashlight whatever get that junk out of my face okay so we're taking those tickets we're taking all of that i'm gonna drink some more water grab the gas steal it and this thing has more gas too but i'm gonna drink just i'll just drink the water and then grab the gas out one more boom we got nine gasoline okay pee a little bit we get to go all right let's go back this time, I'm not gonna go back to the base, but I'm gonna go back to Sector 7. I wanna check out what's in this update in Sector 7. They added those ranks now. Everyone's offline in my clan, bruh. But, uh, I can add them to friends. Okay, I changed ranks, so can't be a clan leader. Leader's the head of the clan. No okay. I think they added ranks or something like that, dude. That's what they added. Wait, access is denied. Location unavailable, please update the app. Oh my god, dude. So, I guess the update came out, but I'm not playing on the update. To be honest, why does the game work if uh, there's an update? Why didn't the game automatically update? Why didn't the Play Store automatically update the goddamn game? Some wizardry going on here. Alright, installing. Okay, we updated the game. A new in version 1.14.1. Yeah, there we go. I don't know why I'm not checking this out at the start of the video, but I guess I'm doing it now. We should be able to go now. Drive. Yes. Finally, the game is updated. At least. Let's see what Sector 7 has to offer for us. And enter. Clan storage. Everything's the same. Personal storage. I have a lot of stuff. Oh, they removed the temporary storage. Because there was a box here. I remember there was a box here. Unless someone just emptied it out. Outpost. Okay, storm starts in 20 hours and 54 minutes. Let's go in our outpost. Bro, my first video was with the Sector 7, and I ended my video with Sector 7, and now I think it's gonna be the same. Okay, so there is a building option. That's cool. I can't even click the building. There's only furniture, right, right, as of now. So you have to make them, I guess. You have to make them and put them down. That's how it works now. So instead of things being down here, you gotta craft them through the crafting menu, and then you put it down. I guess, I guess it's a little bit smarter. You could pick it up, and before the storm hits, you know. So you basically could put things down, and when the storm hits, you just take things out of the outpost, clean everything out, make sure you take all the items out. They added new medicine or something like that, but where is it, huh? Let me go check, uh, let's go to at least two-star zone. Uh, they said, oh, there it is, there it is, blueberries. No, that's blackberries. What? How is it a blackberry if it's a blueberry? Juicy berry with suspicious iron taste. Okay, I ate one. Damn, it actually heals you a lot. So now we can farm food, finally. Now it's easier. So, I think, yeah, now we can easily loot all the stuff we need. Dude, I got like 20 goddamn berries and, uh... Oh, there's ashy bloaters, though, and they added stronger zombies. 
That's what they did. So now they made stronger zombies before there wasn't any ashy bloaters. I see. I guess every box has an ashy bloater, no? But yeah, I could keep looting these berries for days, dude. How much does he heal? I don't even know how much it heals. It doesn't even show how much. But I guess... Dude, the delay though of using road sign, man, it sucks. I don't even need to kill this guy. But it drops me some cloth and all that. Okay, so I'm gonna delete this stuff. I don't need it. Let's see how much it heals. Dude, the healing is so slow. I, I think it's 5 HP, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, it's 5 HP. So I can spam this. I can't spam this? You can't spam this. Oh my god. So you guys cannot spam the food. You literally have to wait till it finishes healing. So they copied Frostborn. If you guys don't know what Frostborn is, it's like a, a game that has a multiplayer. Same as Last Day on Earth, same concept. I already played it on my channel, but uh, I'm not gonna be playing it anymore. It's uh, I don't really like Frostborn. Anyways, uh, no, I have to get spit on, dude. Okay, let's kill this guy. Um, it's pretty hard, man. It's pretty hard to heal up with blackberries, so bandages is the way to go. Um, you use those berries, I guess, to heal up whenever you're out of combat. But can I? Oh, I cannot. I guess I'm gonna use those berries. Oh my god. You have to use the bandage to heal up? Ooh, boy. Now that's a nerf. Now that's a nerf, dude. You cannot spam bandages anymore. Oh, oh, oh. That's a huge change, man. So you can't really farm those zones alone anymore. Yep. Pretty sure you can't. Before, I used to, like, you know, go in with 20 bandages, fist punch them, and that's it. That's all I do. I guess, let me try punching this guy to death. Can I kill him, at least? If I can kill him, that's good. But if I can't... Oh my god, we got it. Oh my god. But for sure, I can't kill the ashy bloater. I cannot, dude. There's no way. That man is a tank. This takes way too long, dude, to bandage up. You can't bandage up during combat, can you? Please tell me you can. Can you? Oh, you can. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. So you can bandage up during the combat. So you literally do this. Okay, and it heals you. And then I heal up again. Oh my god, this is so terrible. This is so freaking terrible, dude. I guess that's how it works. That's how it freaking works. Okay, let's punch him to death now. We got this, guys. We got this. He's dead. Heal up again. Bro, this is taking forever. I don't like this. Berries take forever to heal too. It's gonna be hard to adjust. Man, it's gonna be hard. But they're not gonna do this in single player though. This is only for Sector 7 because since Sector 7 is multiplayer, you know, guys? So yeah. Wow, a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff. I'm gonna delete ropes. I'm gonna eat the beans. Delete that. Delete the bolts. Grab this. Alright, man, and listen, I cannot fit all of this, so I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do. I'm keeping the bolts. But yeah, guys, I have no idea what's happening in Last Day Nerf right now. I need to catch up. Let me know in the comment section um, what am I missing out. And I'll, you know, I'll try to get my hands back on Last Day Nerf because I haven't played in such a long time. I'm not sure what's going on in Last Day Nerf. So make sure to leave some comments and let your boy know. Thank you for watching this video. Let me know if you like those face cam videos. And let me know if you enjoyed this one. Make sure you leave a like and leave some feedback in the comment section. For sure drop that like button because the more you do, the more happy I am. Hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you in the next Lies Inner video. Peace out.